Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video on the channel today, guys. So today I'm gonna make a brief uh, rundown of how Ultra Instinct Sign uh, can be used, how to utilize some of his combos. Uh, they are just right there on the screen for you guys. I made sure to pre-record them in 180p. And I did do this when like 7 in the morning and then I took a break, watched some movies, TV, you know, stuff like that. And then I got right back to it and this is where I'm at now. It is about like 2 o'clock in the afternoon, so just, just to let you guys know. So, as you guys can see on the screen here, I already have the combo set up for you guys, have the gameplay on loop, so then you guys can follow exactly what's going on with the video. So, just remember guys that some of these combos have a habit of not connecting online because of stamina recovery, or the fact that some people are going to teleport out of them to make sure that you do not get this type of damage off of them. As you can see, I am practically doing two bars with um, UI on Trunks Future, which is uh, uh, kind of kind of big. That, that's a lot of damage for, well, a combo type. Especially with UI, but I'm not understanding what's up with his combo damage. For some reason, after like you land a one combo, his combo damage kind of diminishes, which is weird. Like, it's... It's like reduced by almost 20% as you can see there. Like I'm doing a whole big combo that should be doing more than almost like half a bar and it barely did less than a quarter. Uh, there's also the sign uh, of awakening combo for you guys there too. Uh, after, after uh, you know, that one kick, you know, that basic kick, uh, you can land it. Same with um, Super Kamehameha True combo. It is unvanishable. So remember, it is just the five, six hit, six hit square into all, tr into triangle and square combo. Uh, and then right as you see that kick happen, you can go into Super Kamehameha. You know, easy, simple. I mean, done and done deal. But I mean, that's pretty much it in terms of actual combos. Now on to the real stuff. Now off with the heavy and normal stamina breaks. Five hit square is normal stamina break. The six hit triangle square, triangle square um, into down triangle, I mean into up triangle uh, lands too. So just as a reminder, so as you guys can see, this is a heavy stam break and it also can connect to the normal stam break. But just remember that you guys don't have to use that huge long uh, animation to land the heavy stand break you could technically just do it via your squares into triangle square uh triangle square before inputting the last triangle to get it off now off to my most favorite combo string that ui has and that's of the festival preset that's right guys there is a combo with the festival preset that is pretty damn good not gonna lie guys now i know that what you guys are seeing is a huge extender all you guys do is make sure to charge up a key blast while going into that combo and into an instant power blitz it lands a hundred percent of the time just one thing you have to take in consideration that while you're doing a combo like that, make sure that they're low on stamina, either that or make sure that they are broken. So when you're going in for the attack, um, you can still land it or you can even land it mid attack too. So for example, with that combo right there, right, like any combo at all, like the moment you even teleport, hell, you could just press what triangle square triangle no triangle square and then into power blitz and it will land its second variant only works with key based uh attacks i do not think it works with strike based attacks but it does teleport but it does less damage however though it's still a good combo extender nonetheless anyways hope you guys enjoyed the video hope you guys like subscribe comment down below what you guys think of my gameplay and i appreciate y'all's support check in description below for all my playlists and i'll see you all in the next one so i hope you guys enjoyed peace oh yeah don't forget to share and turn the notification bell on